Hello, future Mikola. This is past Mikola. Are you there? I can't be sure. This, this is being recorded in the week of my 75th birthday, three quarters of a century. And if I'm reading the tables on the internet correctly, almost 40% of the white American males born in my birth year have left already, leaving me here behind. Why? I don't know. To talk to you, if you're still there. I hope you are. And I hope you can tell me that the sore on the bottom of your foot, that diabetic ulcer which has been plaguing you for more than a year, uh, tell me that it's healed. Tell me the sore is gone and the foot is still there. That would make me feel a lot better. Since last time I was on YouTube, I dropped 40 pounds. So, future Mikola, have you kept the weight off? Have you continued to lose weight? Have you met your goal? You've got another 10 pounds to go. I hope you, I hope you beat it. Hope you do. One more thing. Have you taken the guitar and the ukulele out of the back of your closet to make more music? Now, I know why you stopped. You stopped because, well, frankly, your talents are mediocre and not really worth listening to. Still, there is some virtue in uh, putting calluses on the ends of your fingers, so I hope you do that. Hope you're making some good music. Until next time, if there is a next time, I'm Mikola. Hello, Future Bing, and congratulations! You hit your goal in the first day! I can only imagine how excited you are. And the stretch goals! How the hell did you raise a hundred thousand pounds in 24 hours? I can't believe it. <laughs> Seriously though, Kickstarter is still going, it still very much needs your help, and there's a link in the down. So it is currently Friday the 19th of January 2018. We're less than a month into this new year, let me give you the lay of the land, okay? What's happening, what's hot, what's not? in 2018. Here in the UK we still have a Conservative government led by Prime Minister Theresa May. Brexit, the colloquial name for that big thing where we try and leave the EU and be our own thing again like before the wars, is still happening. And it seems to be making very slow progress. Negotiations are happening all the time it seems, and every few days there is a new headline, uh, new news about this happening and that person leaving and this team changing building and what does it mean and what are they thinking about in Brussels? Hey, Mandy. I'm just gonna... What's the wire there? Yeah, I'm gonna try and keep your lights up. Don't die. I won't die. I'm gonna work out for 30 minutes in the background and dye my hair. Okay. Because uh, this is the best time If you could try and um, be really quiet and not make the uh, bike make any noise or beeps um, like that or that, yeah. that'd be great. Yeah. <laughs> There's a Republican government in the US led by a former reality TV star, but that doesn't really matter because at the end of today, their government's gonna close down apparently. 2017 saw the phenomenal rise in value of digital currency Bitcoin, which created waves across the planet in all the financial markets in the known universe. Russia are about to re-elect Putin for the 700th time. Tom Hardy's 1999 unfinished rap mixtape just resurfaced on Bandcamp and it's both terrible and great. Life mapped out before they even born. There's only one reason. It's treason. High risk category. Young man go down the toilet if he tries to spoil it for that fat cat. You gotta get that. On January 13th, everyone in Hawaii got a notification saying that a ballistic missile was gonna blow them up. But it was wrong. It was incorrect. And it scared a lot of people. Understandably. Online and in the news, hashtag MeToo and similar campaigns are creating massive public discussions about sexual abuse, discrimination, and gender equality issues. North Korea keep trying to hack people, sometimes successfully, sometimes unsuccessfully. And Grey's Anatomy is back for the second half of its 14th season. And me and Mandy are very excited about it. YouTube entered 2018 on top Black Mirror form with superstar LA vlogger Logan Paul filming the body of a Japanese suicide victim, which has rightly caused a few waves. We're gonna get into that in a later video, it deserves its own. All you need to know right now is that the skin has been well and truly flayed off the body of YouTube, revealing the terrifying hellscape below, consisting of dead bodies and videos where Spider-Man kisses Elsa from Frozen. I'm quite honestly, worried that this might not air on YouTube. That's how weird and messed up it's getting. But what about me, I hear you ask? 
Well, I'm still living in Eleanor with Mandy and Phil. It's a lovely place to live. We're in South London in a lovely neighborhood. We don't much like our downstairs neighbors, but there's great food. I'm still teaching on the film course at Ravensbourne, and I just celebrated one year at the job. I also got into podcasting in a big way last year. I have two main series, I Will Save You From The Future and Pride and Prejudice Lit Edition, which I hope are both still going strong a year from now. I'm still making music, and last year we successfully crowdfunded a third High Five Spaceship album, which I have to make and release this year, and I really haven't done that much work on it, and it's starting to get very real that I need to I need to sit down and write some stuff. I also need to finish Captain Baculum 3, which I finally announced last year and put on pre-order, but it's still not printed! Why can't I just make this stupid comic? It's like six years too late, and I still haven't finished it, and I need to just get it out of the way. If Captain Baculum is not out by the time you're watching this, I resign. I'm also doing freelance editing like I did earlier this week at Sean Hanna, and some social media and strategy consulting for various clients. But what do I want to achieve this year? I mean, besides making Captain Baculum and, and the album and other things that I've said that I will do. I'm gonna consult my diary. Mandy wants to get fitter this Editing year. Me fat. This is what she wants to do. And in her own words, editing made her fat. So every year I buy the same Moleskin diary and uh, at the beginning, just before January starts, I write a little um, list of things that I want to get done. They're not quite like New Year's resolutions. They're not like eat healthier or, you know, don't drink, don't whatever. Um, they're more like specific than that usually. So I'm going to go through them just so that we have a visual record of what I really wanted to get done this year. First one is recommit to my financial and savings systems. There's a little bit of background there. A few years ago I was, um, I found myself extremely poor um, and I really worked on getting better at it, uh, better at managing my money, better at uh, organizing my savings, you know, actually having savings, having systems. And I felt like in 2017 after such a strong a positive year in 2016 that I'd got a bit uh, relaxed about it all. Having the job and having a steady paycheck from my day job has, you know, made it easier to be relaxed with money and I want to get strict again. I want to get back, you know, tune up those systems and make sure that I'm not um, getting out of good habits. So the second one is reach second savings milestone. I have like goals that I want to reach and, and I want to get to the next one on my list. Get PBFB trivia up to date. God damn it! I still haven't finished it. I thought you finished it last year. No! Like last PBFB. Yeah, no I didn't. For the uh, five year anniversary of PBFB, the mini series that we did, I also launched PastBingFutureBing.com, which is the official website of this whole project and of the Kickstarter. And there's still like three or four months worth of episodes that don't have trivia and I that can't, that cannot sit there like that for another year. Release two sketches. Well, I, I'm about to release one, yeah. so that's half of that already done. I can spend the whole rest of the year planning uh, the follow-up. Do three. Oh, no. Do three. That might be a little self-indulgent. I don't want to spoil them. Weirdo. Also, it says two. It says two, You maybe. can make it a three, just have shh, a tail. Shh, shh. It's not past Mandy, future Mandy. Kind of is though, isn't Finish it? and release Yellow Album, yeah. And finally, own the Triforce. So yeah, I mean, I feel like they're attainable goals. I feel like I can do this if I really put my mind to it. I can get all of this done. It's not out of reach. It is entirely realistic. That's me. I'm a realist. I'm a pragmatist. I'm a problem solver. It's just sometimes I get caught up doing new things before I finish the old things. Maybe I should add that as something else I need to work on. If you haven't already, please check out the link in the description and go check out the Kickstarter. We are running uh, this campaign for a whole month to try and raise funds to make a full-length 
PBFBC call. That's two years documented and turned into roughly 365 videos. I'm already enjoying doing it again and I wish I could just go straight into the full year long thing, but it's just not feasible without your help. So please go and check that out. 16 minutes left. Hey, you gotta keep, you know, you said you were rolling it. You were gonna keep cycling. Stop rolling. You gotta keep cycling until I stop recording. That's what you said. Mm. Yeah, you it keep going. Now. The little red light still Ticking away. It's on. It's 17 minutes. It's still going. It's still red. I could wait till the battery runs out. Please don't, this hurts. I ordered this big box from ASOS that is full of hats. He sent me a text saying, do you want to come over and try on 475 pounds worth of hats with me? 